Emily and Jared first met back in year 12, but he doesn't remember it at all. So it's lucky they met once more at uni studying music together. They played together at a strange gig at the meat market early that year and started bonding over Stevie Wonder, David Bowie and Earth, Wind and Fire. As I remember when we asked Emily what she liked in Jared, so this is very early on, she said he was cool. And, and I can see that. I think he's cool. Since we've known Emily, she too is dedicated, strong and focused, and they really complement each other with what they do. They talked about the things they share and the things they love, and the one thing they missed is fermentation. And I'm thinking here about the kimchi, the kombucha, the smelliest laundry in Essendon, and of course they love beer, which I think is quite apparent. Those first moments together set the tone of their relationship, and in the years since, They've spent plenty more time creating and sharing great music, exploring new places, eating and cooking, enjoying beers, whiskey and gin, and playing board games together. I ask everyone here to witness that I, Jared Ian Butler, ask everyone here to witness that I, Emily Louise Clark, to be my lawful partner in marriage. I promise to greet you with as much enthusiasm as greeting Alfie. I will love you, challenge you, grow and learn with you. It's with great pleasure that I now declare you married, you can kiss. To most of you, I'm Emily's younger sister, Genevieve, but really I'm Alfie's auntie, that beautiful greyhound you saw me walk down the aisle. And I'm also Jared's tenant. For some reason they thought it was a good idea to let me live with them. But living with Jared and Emily, I've learnt a few things. I never know what they're talking about because their in-jokes have their own in-jokes. They've created their own language which names all of the kitchen appliances and I, they tell me to get something, I'm not going to get it because I don't know what it is. Our marriage is, is a universal thing, it's all over the world, but the one thing that I've noticed from friends and family is that no two marriages are the same, they're all as individual as the people in those marriages. I think that Emily and Jared have already shown they've found their own way.